ever murdered any? Have you murdered any bugs lately? Uh, actually, uh, what's the last insect you've killed? Would you guess? Oh no, there it was a it was a small flying bug in my back room. Oh, in your house. Yeah, I apologized it for unknowingly crossing the boundary, and I just smashed it. You apologized to it? Yeah. For unknowingly crossing the boundary. I acknowledged that it was ignorant of crossing the boundary. You acknowledged that, that it, was, it, it was ignorant. Yes. Yeah. And I apologized for doing that. <laughs> and I so it was it, like a gnat or something? It was, it was bigger than, I would have said it was a flying ant. Oh, that's exciting. Well, I mean, it's it's. Uh, are you sure it wasn't? Are you one hundred percent certain it wasn't a flying fish? I am one hundred percent sure it was not a flying fish. That's pretty confident of you. What are you, some kind of biology expert? No, but I I, I can do an image search. <laughs> if I saw a flying fish in my apartment, I'd be like, "Well, this looks like a flying fish. I better check to see if this isn't some sort of." Uh, Insect apocalypse. Oh, I was gonna say, would you assume right away that's some sort of like a flying fish flies through your apartment right now while we're talking? Yeah. First, first thought in your head is, is this an apocalypse? Is that your first thought? Oh or? no, 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 no. Why would I? Why would I bother thinking that? that those are my <laughs> dreams. That's what my dreams are for. <laughs> I just you. dream of various apocalypse. Right now, a flying fish just flies through your room into your back room, out of nowhere. You didn't know it was in there. What is Did your I first thought? It? What is your first thought? You, would, I don't know if you'd hear it because you got headphones on, but you would just. Like, what would well, you, you think? Crash through the window, wouldn't it? Like it was hiding in the closet or something, and it just flew out, flew through the room, and then into another room. Oh, so like a mystical flying fish, not like a legitimate no, fish that can like fling itself out of the water and glide for a little bit and then go back in. Like I, just to be sure we're clear, are you talking is about what, is that what flying fish are? They just yeah. launch themselves and back in. They don't have actual yeah. wings and they can't just. Fly. They have. They just have really large fins and they <laughs> they can launch themselves out of the water. <laughs> you have exposed my ignorance. Well, uh, here no, I'm trying to be the smart guy messing around with you, and then you like expose my well, ignorance. I, was, I just want to know, know what a flying fish coming. is. I thought well, maybe they just were like fish with little wings that flew up and then went and then I don't know. But they I mean, fling really, themselves out of the water. So that's I guess in like, this case, it would have to fling itself out of your toilet. Okay, so I'd hear it. So you'd hear it. But, you, but you're but you not within flying fish distance of your toilet where you're sitting, no, are you? No, right. like if, if a flying fish flew out of my toilet, the <laughs> angle it would have to hit yeah. to come out of the door that's behind me. Like yeah. <laughs> for me to be able to see it, like hit the wall. Yeah. It, it, would, have, it would have to... It would be an impossible ricochet. It would be a beyond improbable. So what's just, more, what's more believable that that ricochet happening, okay, or an actual mythical fish that can? I would fly? I would say I would I would go with the uh, ethereal fish, flying fish. I would have to say that it that's would be more like, believable. The ethereal. I, that's flying. more what I want. And oh, yeah, that's more what you want. That's right. Well, so, I mean, the, okay. So the okay, flying now, fish doesn't have the bone structure to make its way up the sewage pipes in the first place. <laughs> you know? Yeah, but you don't know the or like we're not we're not um, we're not speculating so saying, on the origins so of how it got there. Like, but it, as, as far as you know, as toilet. far as you know, some one your neighbor broke in while you were cooking dinner or, or sleeping or and put it in your toilet and you didn't and just snuck out that, that could have happened I in that case it. it could throw it out right maybe your neighbor yeah, no, hit, I mean, hypnotized you fair got, enough. got out his magical taint made fair you enough. forget you saw him okay so somebody breaks into your house you see okay. him you're about to attack him he gets out his taint you're best oh, okay and he chooses to you know show you his taint long enough that you forget all that puts the f- flying fish, fish in, the in your toilet Okay. Leaves, closes the door. You think nothing's happened, and you're not. Because, oh yeah, we're oh, supposed to get on this uh, okay. Zoom call. Yeah. Yeah, 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 so you get on the Zoom call. Now there's a flying fish in your toilet. It does, however, flying fish do, to fly out at that improbable angle, so it bounces off. It flings itself out of the toilet. Yep. Up 
downer. And I'm like, whoa, there's a lot of noise coming from my bathroom right now, Joe. Let me turn around and holy shit, a flying fish just flung itself out of my bathroom. Yes. Is that what you're saying? Yes, that happens. That, that happens. happens. All right. What's your first thought? <laughs> what the fuck is a flying fish? Did, did, did you... I got to My first thought would be, how did a flying fish get in my bathroom? But you probably wouldn't say all that. You'd just be like, oh, the fuck? And then you'd probably go, right? You'd probably just go deal with whatever. No, that, that's that's pretty Or would you finish this? I'm... Would you finish this video? No, no, like, oh, I, 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 I'll I figure that out later. Like, at that point where I was like, I got to go. In that little... Yeah. Playthrough. You would have been gone. Yeah, I would have. I would have taken off my headphones and maybe tried to like angle it so you got it on camera. Okay. So you then, know. then what's your next step? Do you grab the fish or try to look at the origin? No, of, I, like, I, where I, it came I, from? Do I look I, in the bathroom first? Like, I, is there more? No, I, I probably use this towel to grab the fish. Well, that's a towel. Yes. All right. You, so you use the towel to grab the fish. It's almost like Dungeons and Dragons. So you've got the fish yeah. in that towel. I got the fish in this towel. And your choices are fuck that fish. Nope. Or eat that fish. Nope. So what if those were your choices? <laughs> Which were we I, I could only pick zero or one. That was it. Well, let's just say you could either fuck the fish or eat the fish. I hear you can f fish. Or all puppies and children die a slow, horrible death. Which Sorry. one would you do? Like, I mean, <laughs> Sorry, that would puppies be like and children. That would be my instinct. <laughs> like if a mystical, if, if a mystical being came down. Sorry, puppies and children. <laughs> no, I was, I was like, uh, sorry, puppies and children. And then the bean was like, sorry, I'm not, I'm not fucking that fish. I'd be I'm like, oh shit. Fish. But well, what if you chose to eat it and it was the most delicious thing you've ever eaten in your life, and it's just, it makes every other of all your top twenty flavors are are. Tastes like garbage compared to what that tastes like. It's somehow the best flavor ever. So if I chose to eat it, that was what happened. I guess. I I am assuming you are guessing because it's coming. You're pulling it from the <laughs> magical tape. <laughs> no, this is all. I planned all that. I ripped oh, oh, all okay, this no, out. Okay, this is all your ago. hypothetical. This is all from your hypothetical folder. I don't know what it is. What are we yeah, talking about? Day. So. Okay, so I, then okay, if I so ate this fish and it was yeah. the best tasting fish, as far as like the best tasting of anything of I've any ever had, food, not just fish, the best what, thing. Now, ever what's eaten. your question? Uh, is that pretty cool? Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> I mean, it'll be kind of sad because then many, everything else would suck from then on. At least my top 20. Yeah. And then yeah. maybe the well, 21st would then move up the list. Well, it would have to after I realized flying fish are just going to fling themselves from my toilet. Oh, it was a toilet fish. I forgot. You don't want to really want to eat a toilet fish, probably. Well, that's why I was like, I don't want to fuck a toilet fish either. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> fucking fish. But if it wasn't a toilet fish, you'd be fucking that thing all day long. I don't think so. No, I, I don't think so. Okay. I mean, well, I've never fucked a fish. I've never had a desire to fuck. Well, a fish. to each his own, my friend. To True. each his own. And you and I both can choose. Because we're in America. We can choose whether or not to fuck fish. Fucking fish. True. True. Here's another question. Is it inhumane to fuck a fish? Probably. We can't, we kill fish and eat them, right? Because they can't feel pain. Is that what people say? Or is that what we just well, tell I mean, ourselves? Right? We, tell our, we tell ourselves that any lower life form that can't feel pain, but we pretty much know that's false. Okay. Boom. Mm. Burn on everybody. Okay. Well, now well, back well, back up a little bit before the fucking and eating choice. Fucking fish. So you go, your first thing is you're grabbing the fish with the towel. Yes. What do you think your next thing? Like, what would you do now? Oh, yeah, I'm sure you're, you're going to examine it, right? Like, what the? It's like, what the fuck is this? And I would probably move towards the toilet because it's the only place in my apartment with standing water. Yeah, you would have had guessed. At that point, you're guessing where it came from, but it's well, bad. Yeah, and I probably would, in, in, in the interest of trying to keep a fish alive, throw the fish in. Back the, in the toilet. To keep yeah. Alive, right? Yeah. So, which, okay, regardless, make sense. Like after, after about 30 seconds, I'd realize does it make sense the fish is just going to die there, too. Yeah, eventually. Well, it's going to suffocate. It'll run out of oxygen. So is your plan then to find a home for this fish? Is that your no, mission my plan then? is to kill it humanely. Oh, okay. Mm. <laughs> so now your choice is 
do you tell others what happened? Or do you just like, no. I might be crazy. Like, say I wasn't here when it happened. Oh, dude, I would tell others under you the would guise that I could be crazy. A f- yeah, but I could be crazy. A fucking flying very fish well out of my be, toilet. This very well could be a delusion because, you know, I smoke a lot. And that's spend true. a lot of time alone that's, that's in the apartment. <laughs> that's true. And so, and the sad thing is, most people would probably think you're insane. Oh, dude, most right? people do think I'm I'm insane, which I'm fine with. I feel I feel it's kind of free. <laughs> it you is know? freeing at sort of degree, isn't it? You know, yeah. There, there's a there is a there's freedom. A wonderful that. tick quote. Quote from the cartoon Tick. Oh yeah. Yeah. Sanity is a one-trick pony. Is sanity really just a one-trick pony anyway? I mean, all you get is one trick. Rational thinking. But when you're good and crazy. But when you're good and crazy. <laughs> the sky's the, sky's the limit. limit. Carlos Summer here. I hear you can f- fish.